How's it going to all my beautiful subscribers out there? It's the man, the myth, the legend, Quad MFT here. And in today's Call of Duty Ghost video, you guys are going to be taking a look at some PS4 COD Ghost gameplay, 6v6 domination on the map, Chasm, using the using the Honey Badger, it looks like. Now, the Honey Badger, it's a good gun, but we're not here to really talk about too much that's already going on in Call of Duty Ghost. We're, talk we're going to be talking about something that I kind of want to go on in COD Ghost. Now, I did make a video way back when in Black Ops 2, actually probably earlier in Black Ops 2, like April last year, and I I was talking about score streak DLC now there was some sort of a hit video in my opinion I believe I got around 20 to 30 thousand views which is a lot of views for me guys but either way I talked about score streak DLC and score streak DLC just overall that general thought is a really good idea that, that that's only in my opinion though know, I came up with the idea or me and my dad brainstormed and came up with it but either way guys I do think that score streak DLC really can keep the game alive you know it never really actually happened in black ops 2 I really wish it did because getting like a new kill streak every month think, think about how cool that would be guys think about all the different types of videos you could do how many different like different loadouts you could try if you just had one or two kill streaks every month i mean and i'm sure it doesn't take an insane copious amount of efforts to put in another kill streak or anything like that I, I think it takes effort you know don't get me wrong i don't know anything about the coding for playing a video game and actually incorporating another kill streak online and everything but i, I can tell you know they've got a they're a multi multi billion dollar company activision and infinity ward are so i'm pretty sure they can afford some computer nerds to type in extra kill streaks i know it's not that easy you know i've said that multiple times but what I'm here to talk about today is just a few like simplistic ideas how I have for the score streak DLC. So I'm thinking maybe some more assault streaks because as we see, there's only 12 assault streaks and some of them just say, you know, they're not useful. You know, things like the Loki, you know, the Loki's a cool idea, but when you fire the missile in it, it shoots like 45 seconds after. Like it, it's, it's just dumb. You know, there's no reason to actually use the Loki. I'd rather use specialist. But speaking of specialists, maybe have an extra few perks when you get in your full on specialist bonus. You know, maybe I, I think that'd be cool. You know, getting multiple extra perks just because you bought the DLC or something like that but that's also the thing that, try, that Call of Duty is trying to avoid they're trying to make it so just because you pay more you don't do better I, I don't want anything like that I don't want it where the really really rich people do really well and the really really poor people don't do well either I want it to be an even playing line and that's kind of what Call of Duty has kind of come to you know I like that it's not like buying the extra DLC maps make you better or anything or buying that DLC gun the peacekeeper back in Black Ops 2 that didn't make you any better you know it was a good gun it wasn't the best gun I I think they should also release some DLC for you know guns gun dlc in general for cod ghost just basically any dlc i mean I, of course my favorite would be i'd like to see either perk or score streak dlc but score streak dlc i think it's an actual possibility you know i'm sure they they at least thought of it you know either they saw my video which i know they didn't but it, either way you know they just thought of it you know you can't say that it didn't grace their mind and they didn't think about oh maybe what if we added some kill streaks for some dlc you know maybe the, maybe they actually like coded it in but never really you know like publicly released it and told everybody that it was actually in the coding you know i, I don't know guys this is just a completely made up top topic in my head i also think support kill streaks being dlc that would be really cool having having a lot of different you know support streaks because again there's only like 12 support streaks or like nine it's it's something really low like that which is just i don't know in my opinion it's a little bit horrendous I, I think there should be more but you know i'm not one to say anything like i said multiple multiple times but i think it'd be really cool so that's why i'm just kind of putting it out there to you guys but if you guys wouldn't mind drop shotting that like button down below right now guys that helps me out so much i'm putting lots of effort into these videos ideas commentaries gameplays everything getting the new consoles gameplay just I, I love all you guys I, I don't know how I could uh, how I could even be here without you guys I wouldn't be here without you guys but a little bit more talking about the next gen consoles in this gameplay this is of course like i said earlier on the ps4 i'm really really digging the ps4 the ps4 is it looks so sleek and so crisp and so new and i don't know i just love it it's so clean to find cut and crisp that's what i wrote down a little bit earlier that i think the ps4 really really pulls off call of duty you know think about it in two or three years because if you go back and you think about call of duty 2 that was played on the ps3 and the xbox 360 now if you go back and you think about cod ghosts on the on the Xbox 360 and the PS3, that's just hugely different. You know, the graphics look like look like 10 years difference. I mean, they are a really big difference. Not not quite 10 years, but you know, they're a really big difference. So think about if they got better at coding for the Xbox One and the PS4, where the graphics could be at in three or four years, maybe even like six or seven years. Just think about that. Think about how much. Like, oh, I, I I don't even want to talk about it anymore because it's getting me it's getting me anxious just to see better and better graphics go on and on. Because for me right now, I've played Call of Duty on the PC. I've every Call of Duty on the PC 
except for COD Ghost, mainly because of the fact that I knew the next generation consoles were coming out, and I knew that would kind of supplement for it. And I, I don't know. I just thought I'd try it out, but I really do think the new uh, the new generation consoles, at least what I've seen, the PS4, not the Xbox One, because that's not out yet. What I've seen is it really, really looks like it really resembles PC, which I uh, don't get me wrong, guys. PC gameplay, PC, you know, colors and everything like that look gorgeous. Things like having a really, really great graphics card, a lot of RAM, really fast hard drive, all those things can amount towards helping your gameplay look a lot better, which I think they did put a lot of effort into picking out all the different parts for the PS4 and the Xbox One, which they're similar. I mean, I'm sure there's very, very minute differences, but either way, guys, they're really, really similar. But that's what I have to say about the gameplay. Clean, cut, crisp, and defined. I really, really like it. I hope the Xbox One pulls through and looks insanely good. Hopefully, better than the PS4, but hopefully looks at least just the same. That's what I want, at least just the same. I mean, it looks really promising. Looks like a really good console, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video talking about Score Streak DLC and the new next-gen consoles. It's been Quantum FT. Like I said, make sure to click that like button down below. I love it when you like it, guys. Make sure to subscribe if you beautiful people haven't already, guys. I'm going to be uploading a lot, and I have been uploading a lot. All my, all, blah, blah, all my social media links there in the description below. Check them out, guys. I'm really active on there. I interact with a lot of you guys. It's been Quantum FT, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next Call of Duty Ghost video.